gotta get out of the way. This is dangerous business. It looks so good and I'm so excited and pleased. We're out here in the dark and we had a huge surprise. And now we wait. Good morning. We woke up this morning at Bee Free Acres, enjoying the beautiful view, had some coffee this morning, a little fire. I actually woke up late. Usually we're 5 a.m. people. This morning I think it was probably 7.30 or 8 before we finally drug ourselves out of bed. And it's a little chilly this morning. It is actually uh, overcast, um, but it feels good. It feels good. But now it's time to get to work. Yeah, my favorite stuff, cutting trees. Well, so we have our beautiful view here, but as the trees and the leaves have begun to grow, we've noticed that our view is becoming smaller and smaller. So there's some trees that have to go. And if you haven't watched the DIY video on Bee Free Benson DIY, we've got a whole series on there that has to do with chainsaws and starting them and safety equipment and all of that. But we're gonna put that to the test today and cut a few trees. That's we are. Let's get at her. We'll get at her. Get out of the way. Come on, come on, come. This is dangerous business. from Bee Free Acres. It is a beautiful morning and we are up super early. We have a ton of things planned for this week and lots of exciting stuff. And this morning, the first thing that we are doing is we are having a some rocks delivered, some huge boulder rocks that have to go in before we start building because we won't be able to get them back here otherwise. And we also are going to be putting in a fire pit. So we need to get ready for them to come with the rocks because they're so heavy that we have to have them place them. And we've got to get the spots ready. We already have some rocks up at the front and they look so good. And we're gonna add one rock to the front of the driveway. But we've gotta chisel out a spot for it, which is what we're gonna do, hopefully, with the tractor. Now I'm gonna get the shovel and the rake and just make sure it's uh, nice and smooth. Let me show you how this looks. It looks so good and I'm so excited and pleased with how it turned out. So next week we have some Adirondack chairs coming and we're gonna stain them the same color as the, the wood beams that we have for the house and the wood door. So those Adirondack chairs will be around the fire pit. We also have an insert coming because we're gonna turn this outdoor fire pit into one that is run by propane so it's easy to turn off and on. And you can also use wood too, but we like the propane because of the ease. And we were able to take our rocks and get them all situated. And we put a little tiny wall on the front to give us some separation between the driveway and our garden area. It looks really good. I'm really, I'm really pleased with how it turned out. We're out here in the dark 
and we had a huge surprise. We have electricity at the property. So as you saw last night when we pulled in here and we're so surprised by the electricity, now you can see it during the day. So the electric company has brought in their trucks and they are now working on the electricity to all three of our family compound bee free acre sites. So as you may know, we have a bear out here or actually several bears. And some of the neighbors have said they have seen huge bears like 600 pounds. So I really would love to see a bear. And you know, we have those footprints. So we know one's here. So we have purchased some bear cams, some cameras that we can put out here that are good for security, but also more importantly, hopefully we will see a bear and some wildlife. So we will put a link in the description so you can see what cameras we used, but we're gonna go ahead and install those and hopefully see some bears. So we got these uh, 4G LTE cellular tra tra trail cameras so we can actually check it on our phone even when we're not here. And it came with two of them. So now we just gotta figure out how to do this. All right, so this is the cell phone activated camera that we got. Uh, it's supposed to have good night vision. Uh, it's got the solar panel on top and the cellular antenna. You can hook it up via a um, connector here where you screw it into something like a tree or a post or you can use a strap. So this is what we'll be able to see and when somebody or something like a bear wiggles, we'll see it. And now we wait and watch. Well, we've been rocking the family compound this week and babysitting Winnie, getting all kinds of stuff done. Our view, getting our view opened up. It's a little breezy out here too. It's a little breezy, but it feels good. It feels real good because it's been hot. So we had some storms come through and dumped a friggin' butt ton of rain and now it's cool. So hopefully you can hear us. Yep. So that's it for this week. Yeah. We rocked the family compound. We did. So, get out there. Wait, I don't even know what we say uh, anymore. Yeah. Which one is it? Rocking the family compound. But. So get out there, have an adventure, find a family compound, and be free. See you in the next adventure. <laughs>